so <clears throat> I got the throttle mapper um, installed um, the instruction wasn't that clear so I had to call mini models and make sure that I put the stand on the right place so I don't want to mess up my stuff um, but we'll try it right now and you guys can see and of course uh, you can program this um, this is a video also the guy showing how to program this so you can change different um, settings um, that you want but I think three ways already at <laughs> works for me um, so do this Uh, I put my Apple kick to start. So you see that? Start rolling really smooth. And when you want the full power, you can just go for it. That's that full power right there. So, but you just that now you have this smooth like when you click on the throttle it's like super smooth can just cruise see that it's not that kick anymore that try to throw you off the board you know I mean you still have that if you wanna see that you still got that but now you have to really press on it anyway I'm gonna turn this thing off. Um, disconnect this and plug in back the way it was so you guys can see the difference. Um, uh, so I'll do that right now and then we'll see the difference. I do not have um, somebody holding this, so just gonna. Let's hold this Go ahead and turn off the switch Unplug this too I'm plugging the cable. Get that out. Plugging it into the original. Sorry guys, I haven't been feeling too well, so so I haven't been making any videos. So now we got that plugged back in into the original. 
controller without this. Uh, I'm gonna turn this back on and uh, I'm gonna try it. Let's see if you can see the difference. <coughs> You see the difference? It's still a lot of way too much power. You see that? You can see that this is way, way more aggressive. Way more, way more aggressive than when you have that throttle map on there. See that? You just want to rip off um, when you tap on the thing. But um, with the map, uh, there's a little bit more control. So, um, turn this off. Go ahead and install it. Um, again and uh, like I said you guys can adjust this of course um, <clears throat> just gonna go ahead and install it back up I'm gonna put this thing down here. Um, This is actually the, the first time I'm opening my the deck on the Thunder. I do not like I do not like messes and I don't like things looking out of place. So I'm gonna figure out a way to set this thing up so it's not like just hanging off right there but now install the right back and turn this on and let's do that test one more time so you guys can see it. See that? That slow is rolling. Once you get past this part, you can really let it go. And that's when that's when you feel the full power. But you know, you can cruise. Look at that. It's rolling right there. Really 
cruise and if you want the full power it's right there oh, oh. all right um thank you guys for watching um sorry i've been away like i said i haven't been feeling too well but thank you guys for watching if you do have any questions <coughs> feel free to ask i just thought that this is important um to um, let you guys know and update you guys on some of the stuff that um, I'm doing um, on the scooter. Got some lights installed up here. Um, like I haven't been riding because I haven't been feeling too well. But <sighs> got this installed. <laughs> Need to get it tucked in somewhere. Keep it clean and um, cover this deck back up. But if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, and thank you for all the subscriptions um, that I've been getting. Appreciate y'all. Have a wonderful day.